First of all, I'd like to welcome all of you and thank you for taking the time to join us. My name is Lisa Torgerson and I'm the Director of Leisure Travel Services at TravelX International. And I'm happy to introduce um, Max and our partnership with Sea Dream. But I do want to, before we get started, I do want to mention that there's either a Q&A box at the bottom of your screen or a chat box at the bottom of your screen. If you have questions, please feel free to type them in as we're going through the presentation and we'll be happy to answer them at the end of the presentation. Um, again, at the bottom, you'll see a Q&A box or a chat box. So just type them in there. Um, and Max, I'm gonna turn it over to you so that you can share with us all things Sea Dream. Well, wonderful, Lisa, thank you. And thank you everyone for joining us tonight. Um, and I'm super excited to talk about yachting and yachting with Sea Dream. And we'll call this um, uh, evening sea dreaming the future. But before we uh, talk about the future and the yachting concept, let's meet our founder, Atle Bernestad, who is a Norwegian entrepreneur. Um, uh, many of you might not know uh, that Atle was actually the original founder and uh, owner of Seaborn, um, uh, Seaborn Cruise Line. And many, many decades ago, he sold it to Carnival Corporation. He also was a chairman of Cunard. Uh, so he is definitely not new to the industry. And he took some time off to study yachting. And as a visionary as he is, he wanted to create something new, very revolutionary. And that's how Sea Dream Yacht Club came to life. We are a very small family boutique company. We only have two mega yachts and you are looking at them, Sea Dream 1 and Sea Dream 2. And our motto, our uh, tagline for the last 20 years has been, it's yachting, not cruising. And oh boy, I say how relevant it is today. Um, of course, nothing is wrong with cruising. You probably all have been on a cruise before. And cruising, it's a, cruising, it's, it's a very much indoor experience, right? You eat inside, you dance inside, you gamble inside, you have shows inside. Uh, but when you're on a yacht, it's a very outdoor experience. And many of you probably have seen yachts before, either you know, on a lake or if you have been in the Caribbean or Mediterranean, the luxury yachts, you see everybody's out. They, they eat outside, they have cocktails outside, you literally can put um, your feet into the water from the, you know, from the back of the yacht. And this is what the Sea Dream experience is. I love this photo, isn't it fabulous? That's what yachting is, unique yachting ports. This, as a matter of fact, is a picture of um, one of our yachts in, um, in Norway, where, uh, where we're currently sailing. We actually were fortunate to resume operations um, at the end of June, and it speaks again highly of, of, of just being a small family-owned company. We don't have the board of directors. We need to report and, and wait for answers. We can quickly react to the ever-changing environment right now. And um, uh, we um, were able to move um, Sea Dream 1 originally to Norway. And uh, because of high demand, we uh, moved Sea Dream 2 as well. So both yachts are now sailing um, uh, uh, up Norway, uh, uh, doing the fjords, and they will be there until September. So we are very, very humble and, and excited that we are the first luxury cruise line to resume operations. So let's talk, let's start talking about the future and, and really what our yachting experience is. First of all, it's very important to know we now have 20 year track record of delivering exceptional service. As a matter of fact, the company started two months before 9-11. So uh, talk about starting a company uh, right before this tragedy. We survived it. We persevered uh, by 2008, 2009 economic uh, depression. 
and here we are, as I said, the first luxury cruise line to resume operations. We are family owned, we're debt free, and we're very versatile. We can quickly change itineraries and adapt to this ever-changing environment. And we're very vital. Our yachts offer a very active, naturally healthy outdoor environment. And you will learn that through this meeting tonight. Atlas vision was to really create a very casual, but the luxury experience. Um, our guests are hardworking individuals like you, many of them you know, still work, um, and they are looking for a seven day escape. They want to rejuvenate, rekindle uh, the relationships, reconnect uh, in a very casual, non-pretentious way. And this is exactly what Sea Dream delivers. This is how you're welcomed on a yacht. You're welcomed by a captain. Here in the picture, you see uh, one of our hotel directors. Of course, right now, no hugs, no, um, no, um, no handshakes. And you are greeted by uh, a glass of champagne. Um, and uh, you are taken into your stateroom. This is your yacht. From the time you step on board, we want to make you feel like it's your private yacht. Each yacht welcomes 112 guests, 95 crew members. So it's a very high touch, high level, personalized experience. So, and you can imagine nearly one to one guest to crew ratio. I have attached, these are actually actual pictures from our guests um, uh, that have sailed with us in the past. This is that personalized sea gym experience. Of course, when, when you're on a yacht, as I mentioned before, it's a very outdoor experience. We dine al fresco. We uh, have an indoor restaurant and we typically use it in the beginning and the end of the voyage. But when we cruise the sexy Caribbean islands and you know, fabulous Mediterranean ports, who wouldn't want to eat outside. So we have an outdoor restaurant that actually can seat everybody. And we have different tables, um, you know, that can seat two or five. We can merge tables for families and um, we dine al fresco. Uh, how beautiful. Because we're a yacht, you know, we're not a ship, we're not a small ship, we are a mega yacht. We anchor or we dock for most, uh, for most time of the day. So we can comfortably enjoy the meals outside. And as a matter of fact, when I ask our past guests and I, I ask them, what's your favorite moment on, on Sea Dream? Of course, everybody talks about our service, that personalized uh, and pretentious service. But second memory is our dream cuisine. Um, it's prepared a la minute with the freshest local ingredients. Um, but even if you have um, special dietary needs or, or, or special restrictions, our executive chef will sit down with you and will prepare a customized menu for the duration of the voyage. We even have a five course gourmet, vegan, raw, and gluten-free menu. How fascinating is that? Again, it's Atlas, Atlas Vision. He is very, very into wellness. I mean, talk about uh, having all these choices and that food, that five course gourmet vegan menu are actually so good. We encourage other guests, even if you don't follow that, that diet, to try it. And you know, yachting is fun. We don't take ourselves seriously. Um, again, these are pictures uh, from, from our real guests. Our top of the yacht bar outside is very, um, is very popular with guests. It's a, it's, it's a very uh, social place. Our guests love uh, mingling together. You know, uh, uh, they're very social. They love meeting new friends. Um, uh, uh, it's, it's, it's just very, very casual. Remember, very casual. We have, um, uh, you know, the night entertainment, of course, is not like on a big ship. We don't have big theaters. 
we have a, uh, you know, a crew member with talent will play a guitar. We have a piano bar. We have uh, a casino. Wait, one blackjack table. Um, uh, but again, because we 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 spend so much time uh, in port, uh, our guests also love getting outside and enjoying local uh, local cuisine and some famous local uh, restaurants. Uh, also, if you are a golf aficionado, we have a golf simulator, but because we cruise um, in the Caribbean and we stop in some very world famous golf courses, uh, we also can, can help and recommend some, uh, uh, some award winning golf courses as well. And at night, again, you can be as, 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 as relaxed as you want or as, as active as you want. So at night we uh, do movies under the stars. We bring international teas and popcorn. Uh, I had one guest actually share with me when she was sailing in the Mediterranean and the Greek Isles. Um, uh, we were watching, we were showing Mamma Mia and she just turned her head and uh, uh, we were passing the island where that Mamma Mia episode uh, portion of the movie was filmed. So she f felt almost like she was in, in 3D. Again, it's your yacht. It's your sea dream. So you really can make whatever you want out of uh, experience of sea dream. Uh, as a matter of fact, many of our guests are actually very active. A yacht, what, what yacht would be without a water sports marina? Uh, we have every single water sports toy you can imagine. A jet ski, a kayak, a banana boat, a trampoline, a sailboat, and we actually use it. And it's available complimentary. Every time we anchor a yacht, we, um, we open the marina and we use it. And we use it. Each yacht has 10 mountain bikes. Again, they are available for your complimentary use. Our crew hosts uh, complimentary crew-led activities. So again, our crew member might uh, gather a small group of, you know, three, five couples, and we'll do a bike tour of the island or a beautiful hike. Again, just imagine hiking some of these beautiful uh, islands in the Caribbean and, and hiking on top of the island and just seeing that breathtaking view. Of course, we have a state-of-the-art uh, gym. So again, you can stay active and, uh, and keep up with that active lifestyle you have. That's actually one of our guest favorites uh, in the Mediterranean, our chef will um, will um, uh, host a complimentary uh, uh, tour of the uh, of the city where uh, he will take guests to the local market and will get some fresh produce uh, for, for the evening and will you know uh, walk the guests around the island again if you do choose and you want to do perhaps a shore excursion we offer them for a nominal fee I love that. Complimentary yoga and Tai Chi classes daily. That's fascinating. Again, we host them in a uh, semi-private area on the beach, as you can see here, or uh, in a private area on the deck. We offer a, um, uh, we have the only Thai certified spa at sea. If you guys had a Thai massage before, uh, I, I had a Thai massage before. That was the best massage I ever had. And the only other Thai certified spas are in Thailand in luxury hotels and resorts. And we, we offer them on, on Sea Dream. We actually have five masseuses on each yacht. So it's quite, uh, quite amazing. That's a lot of masseuses for a small yacht. You will never have to wait for a spa treatment. Our famous signature Balinese dream beds. Don't you love that? I, I just, I, I take me there. I, I want to be on one of these beds right now watching the sunset. Uh, Cruise Critic uh, named us uh, last year in December, actually the best luxury cruise line for romance. And you can probably see why, right? Because of all these unique experiences that you can experience on Sea Dream. We have a number of these Balinese beds. You can see they're elevated, the view is unobstructed. And um, during daytime, 
um, again, you just grab a book, um, you hop on one of those beds, uh, you read a book, we bring cocktails, we bring fresh fruit, uh, but at night, uh, that's my favorite time uh, of the day to, to get on a bed. At night, we actually cover them with a fine um, a Belgian linen. And every guest on the first night of the voyage gets personalized monogram pajamas. Remember, it's your yacht. It's your yacht. You can do whatever you want. And so many of our guests put them on. They get out of their cabin. They go to the top of the yacht bar, get cocktails. And so many couples just fall asleep watching the Milky Way and just millions, millions of stars. Our signature champagne and caviar beach splash party is another one of our signature experiences. We usually host it at the end of our voyage. Again, real pictures from our real guests. We uh, usually hosted um, St. Bart's, Jost van Dijk, um, again, in a semi-private beach area. Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a party. It's talk about a, a fabulous Instagram moment. Uh, we do the barbecue, we grill, you know, ribs, chicken, salads, but the uh, champagne and caviar is again the, the favorite of our guests. You can see the crew gets into the water with their white uniform. Um, they, um, uh, uh, guests just love it. Guests just love this, this fabulous experience. So let's talk about um, where we sail. So if you start dreaming about yachting and sailing with Sea Dream, let me take you to our uh, intimate ports uh, uh, of where you can join us uh, in, 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 the, in the near future. So right now, as I mentioned, the yachts are in Norway. Obviously, uh, we cannot travel to Norway, but in November, we will move both Sea Dream 1 and Sea Dream 2 to the Caribbean. And the yachts pretty much follow the sun. So in the winter, in the fall and winter, the yachts are in the West Indies. And then in the summer, from April until September, uh, the yachts are in the Mediterranean. And when I talk about Caribbean, think sexy Caribbean, think West Indies. Uh, when I do, you know, when I used to do these events uh, and meet clients face to face, sometimes clients would say, oh, I've been there, done it, I've done Caribbean, maybe not interested. Wait a second, St. Bart's. Saba, Anguilla, these are yachting ports, just fabulous, fabulous, unique ports. Unless you stay there in a private luxury villa uh, or you come there on, on, a, on a luxury yacht, it's very, very unlikely that uh, you have been there. And uh, uh, I really highly encourage you to, to, to look at our itineraries and really study them because uh, uh, actually when I do talk to our past guests, they say, yes, we are small and we're this, but it's the ports that really entice uh, uh, clients to, to book us. I want to touch base on our holiday sailings. Um, in a normal world, uh, it would be impossible to get space uh, on Sea Dream to travel during holidays. Well, of course, in our new normal, we do have some, some limited space. So I really encourage you to reach out to one of your travel advisors at TravelX International and, um, and, and check to see what's available. Uh, on, on many of our voyages uh, this fall and winter in the West Indies, we offer a $500 off per stateroom uh, savings. And because you're working with a virtuoso agency, every booking will receive an exclusive $200 spa credit. So you can get pampered and get a Thai massage. So let me take you now to the Mediterranean. Gosh, dreamy, dreamy ports. Monte Carlo, Portofino, Idra, Seville. Again, those fabulous small ports. Let me touch base on Monte Carlo. I love that. Uh, I also met a client last year who, when I asked her, what is your favorite moment of, about sailing with Sea Dream? She said she was shocked when we docked in Monte Carlo. We docked right there, right in Monte Carlo. And she woke up and she, you know, went with her bathrobe, you know, and a cup of coffee. 
she got outside and she was blown away that she saw all those multi-million dollar yachts. But on the left side, there was a Bill Gates yacht docked right next to us. And on the right side, there was some Russian billionaires yacht docked to, docked to us. So again, talk about yachting. Remember, it's yachting, not cruising. We have fabulous Greek Isles itineraries. Of course, we go to Mykonos and Santorini, but we also go to small, small ports like uh, Patmos and Rhodes. Um, next year, we, we're going back to the Black Sea and uh, uh, we're offering some overnights in Israel. So really, again, uh, if, you're, if you're looking for that uh, unique itinerary and small, uh, undiscovered ports, uh, uh, we would love to take you there. Talk about, again, something on bucket list, cruising through the Corinth Canal. Again, uh, very few uh, companies can do it. You have to be a small ship or a boat. Um, and we do it on our Rome to Athens or Athens to Rome itinerary. It's a fun, again, just fun, fun experience. We do it during sunset. We serve Bellinis. Just again, another cool Instagram moment. So let's talk about COVID-19. Um, again, as being a luxury company, uh, the safety of our guests and crew has always been our number one priority. We are constantly, constantly following guidelines and protocols set by CDC, CLIA, and the World Health Organization. Uh, of course, we are saying goodbye to buffets right now. Uh, no longer will guests be able to select items from our outside buffet area. You will be seated by the table and uh, you will be able to select it from the menu that will be brought to you by our crew member. Uh, when you board the yacht, you will have to submit a guest declaration prior to boarding. We check the temperature, oxygen level, and uh, uh, blood saturation levels. Now, this is very important. Each stateroom has its own air circulation and air filtration system. So that's, that's really cool. Um, and uh, both yachts have its own air circulation and filtration system. As you can see from these pictures, we clean the luggage. When, when the luggage comes to our yacht, we actually use electrostatic cleansers. Um, we use sterilizing lamps in our cabins. Uh, we basically constantly, constantly sanitizing all surfaces that are touched by, by our crew and the guests. If you have been again on a cruise before, even in the old days, I, I remember, you know, you always see crew members cleaning the elevator buttons, cleaning the handles, the railings. Well, we do it now so much more often. And of course, if we do have a new crew member joining the fleet, as a matter of fact, we were fortunate that most of our crew stayed with us on board. Uh, but if we do have uh, a new crew member joining us, they are of course screened. They must take a blood test a day prior to leaving their home country. Of course, we check their temperatures and uh, we check their blood saturation and oxygen levels. But right now in Norway, for example, we're also quarantining them for 10 days in a local hotel. So this is just a sample, just a small sample of what we're doing today, of what we're doing today. Uh, if you're gonna travel with us in January or March, uh, again, as I mentioned, the situation is so fluid and, and so dynamic. But let's talk about the fun stuff. Let's talk about the assurance and the confidence that so many of you are really needing to kind of continue to dream about travel. Um, so we come up with this ultimate booking assurance. And when I tell you about this program, you will see why the name has the ultimate word in it. Um, if you are eating uh, to travel and, and, and you love this concept of, of casual yachting on Syndrome, and perhaps you, you are looking maybe on our website already and looking at some of the itineraries and you want to travel, we would love to welcome you on board. But we also want to give you confidence in order to, to make a booking. 
So uh, it's easy. There is no fine print. There is no secret words. Our ultimate booking assurance guarantees 120% future voyage credit, voyage credit or full cash refund for all new bookings from now until June 30th of next year. So it's basically that the next 10 months of, of uncertainty. So if your travel is affected by any government travel restriction, you can cancel a day to departure and either get a full cash refund or 120% future voyage credit. But if you just don't feel like traveling, maybe, you know, it's almost like cancel for any reason. Again, we understand. You can cancel until the day of departure and we will offer you 100% future cruise credit. Talk about ultimate booking assurance policy. So again, if you want some more details on this, please reach out to one of your travel advisors at TravelX International and they will be able to assist you. And if you're celebrating any special occasions, milestones, weddings, birthday, you know, maybe you own a company and you're thinking of a corporate retreat, we would love to, to welcome you on one of our yachts. Because of our size, um, uh, charters are very popular. Really, at the end of the day, we only have 56 cabins on, uh, on, uh, on either one of our yachts. So again, one of your TravelX International travel advisors will be able to assist you with that. So with this said, I welcome your questions and answers. So again, um, if you have a question, you can type it in the Q&A box or you can type it in the chat box. So Max, on the ultimate insurance, um, a question that I have is, is there a cost to that? Is it like an insurance um, no. policy? No, Lisa, fantastic question. I'm glad you asked it. No, it's, it's just part of our new bot booking policy. It's, it's part of the new booking policy and it's for new bookings from today for sailings until the end of June. There is no cost to that. Perfect, perfect. We had one comment um, from someone that I guess one of the pictures they said excellent view. I think I saw quite a few excellent views. Right. I mean, talk about, I love this picture. Talk about yachting, right? I think it says it all. It's yachting, not cruising. And really what I want to take, you know, for you to take away from this uh, uh, presentation today is just how different it is. Uh, you know, if you, if you're an outdoor person, if you have done river cruises before, um, if, if you're an active person, uh, Sea Dream really will appeal to you just because of that outdoor experience, calling on small intimate ports, you know, also being an all-inclusive product. All our gourmet cuisine is included, all our uh, liquor is included, all um, uh, drinks, cocktails, wine, and it's premium liquor, all gratuities are included, water sports, toys, bikes, crew led activities. So you think you just have to get there. Yeah. And then another person commented, great presentation. And the last picture gives you the outlook on what the difference is between yachting and cruising, because we see a big cruise ship there. Um, they're asking, how can we get access to your rates? Exactly. So you would contact one of your TravelX uh, international travel advisors. Um, of course, uh, they can advise you on our sailings and on the sailing calendar and the availability. Okay. And, and that is something if you don't have an advisor and you're joining us, you can simply call our office and we can definitely get someone to assist you as well. Um, another question that's in the Q&A box, Max, is she's asking on that last picture, is the small ship on the right the yacht? And wow, what a difference between Royal Caribbean and Sea Dream. Exactly, right. It's one of our yachts, yeah. Sea Dream 1 and Sea Dream 2, they're twin yachts, 112 guests, 95 crew members. So that's, you know, from the time you step on board we want to make you feel like it's your yacht and that's really why people come back to seizure we actually have 60 percent repeat 
guest ratio, which is the highest in the industry. And it's really because, you know, our crew has been with us for, for, for a long, long time. Um, one of the slides with the caviar and champagne beach party on the kayak, we had um, our executive chef, Tomas, and originally he signed a one-year contract. 16 years later, he is still with Sea Dream. Jamie, that was also next to him in the picture, he is our hotel director. Again, the same thing. He originally signed the one-year contract. Ten years later, he's still with Cedrum. It's a family. It's a family. And then another person, and I've had this question asked on many different occasions, but maybe I'll let you answer it, Max. Is, um, they don't drink alcohol. Is there a discount on the tickets? Do no, there is no, because it's an all-inclusive pricing with Sea Dream. Um, uh, the pricing is the same for, for all our guests. Perfect. Um, I think that's all of our questions, unless some people are typing, which we can hang out here because we've got some time for that. Um, and, you know, Max, I know we were talking, and I can't remember if it was December or not, but you had a promotion on a five-day Caribbean, if I'm we not do. mistaken. As a matter of fact, yes, Lisa. So if, if you they are... would want to, if they want to try it, you know, it's a five-day. So would you ex explain that to them as well? Absolutely. We have a four-day voyage, which is actually a remnant from a charter. As I mentioned, we do charters and we can do as low as a three-day charter. And you know these are popular with weddings. So we actually have a wedding charter uh, prior to that. And um, uh, we have now a four-night voyage, which is the remnant of that on December 8th. It's St. Thomas to St. Thomas. Uh, because we're very port intensive, as you will look at our itineraries, you know, we're not a cruise. We don't cruise, we don't have days at sea. We do yachting, it's coastal yachting. We spend a lot of time inland in you know in port anchored docked so uh we have that fabulous four-day voyage it's saint thomas to saint thomas and the rates start as low as 12.99 per person class port charge it's to me when you look at everything we offer what a great way perhaps to you know, escape if you are, again have been locked in your house, you know, for a long time and hopefully again December things will be, you know, we will be in a better position. But again, you know, look at our ultimate booking assurance policy that really should give you confidence you need to perhaps plan your vacation. Um, and one of your, you know, the advisor at TravelX you work with can also go through our cabins. We have, um, you know, we don't have too many uh, categories because again we're a small product uh, but we have uh, cabins on deck two three and four uh, they are all windows with their all ocean view deck two cabins have two portholes and deck three four they have large picture wind picture windows none of our cabins have balconies because yachts don't have balconies a yacht is your balcony. A balcony is bad is your balcony. You really don't spend any time in your cabin. So again, your advisor can give you pricing for these uh, categories. And of course, we have uh, luxury suites. We have a fabulous admiral suite and an owner suite that have uh, fabulous, fabulous accommodations. But they do go first because we only have one of each. Perfect. Well, I don't see any additional questions, but I will say if you think of them later, um, you can reach out to our office or reach out to your advisor and they're happy to answer any questions. And if we don't have the answer, we certainly can get a hold of Max. Max is very easy for us to get a hold of um, and we can find out the answer for you. But um, I want to thank everybody for joining us. And Max, I thank you for joining us and, and giving us a wonderful way of dreaming. I know it, it makes me want to go on the yacht versus the big vessel. Thank you. And thank you for your partnership. Thank you for your time tonight. Keep dreaming. Keep, 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 keep thinking of your next vacation. And, Have a good somebody, evening, everybody. And somebody else said thank you for the presentation. So thanks again, Max. And, and we'll see everybody next time. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.